most Linux distributions come with an IRC client pre-installed. In today's exercise, I am using Zubuntu for this demonstration. The way you can find out is by clicking on your menu and going into Internet. and You may see an IRC client there. If you don't have one, you can get one easily by opening your package manager. For those of you using an Ubuntu-based distribution, you can get it from the Ubuntu Software Center. Once you have XChat IRC installed, open the program. The first thing you're going to need to do is select a username that no one else has. I will use the name Mamoulian. He was a character in Clive, one of Clive Barker's books I remember reading. And number two, just in case somebody does have that name. I doubt it, though. Next, under the networks listing here, we're going to scroll down to Freenode. We're going to select to edit this. Okay, now, we are going to select to auto-connect to this network at startup. And later, we're going to be adding a NixServe password. You're going to need this. Let me show you why. I'm going to go ahead and close this now, and then press Connect. Okay, the prompt is going to come up, and I'm going to uncheck this to always show this dialog after connecting because this can be quite annoying. We're going to select to join this channel and it is hash or the pound symbol spatry. Okay. We're in. So why don't we say hello? It says you cannot send to the channel. Ooh. Well, what do we do? Okay, here's a tutorial I found online. You're going to click to go into the free node room, and then you are going to need to issue a command, and it will be this one. Message Nick serve register. Then you will type in a password, and then an email. Then press enter. Now, I have already registered this name, but if you do it correctly, it will give you a message stating that you have been registered and that there is an email located in your inbox. So we'll back this up here and we'll look into the email. And here it is. And you will see it is giving you a line that you will need to copy and paste into this message box. You would message Nixer, verify, register, and this code here. You would just copy that, and then right-click and paste, then press enter. Ooh, we don't want that wonky little character there. And then just press enter, and it will give you a message stating that uh, you are good to go. Okay, now let's go into XChat here because now we need to authenticate. So by going into the network list under free node and then selecting edit, we can type in our password. And now it will authenticate us every time we log in. I'm going to go ahead and close this. Okay, and then I'm going to close this window as well. Let's close this. And now, the next time we log in, and we connect, it looks like it's trying to log in twice. This is Mamoulian2. It's not a registered nickname. We'll go ahead and close that. But we are now identified for Mamoulian. Forward slash, forward slash, join, hash, Spatry will get us in the chat room. And now we can say hello. 
and the message has been received. But suppose you want to automatically log in. By going into XChat on the network list, we can edit here, and then see these three little dots next to this box? We can add that channel. And so we'll just uh, mark out channel here and type in SPATRY, and then press Enter, and OK. And that setting is now saved. You can go ahead and close this now. And so then we can get in there and uh, it'll automatically open up. Let's put that to the test here. I want to close this and we'll try it again. It looks like it's already connecting, so we don't need it to show this. So we can now check to skip the network list at startup and close it. We are identified. We are now in the room, and everything is good to go. Well, I hope that answers you guys' questions about getting into the chat room and being able to communicate, and I look forward to seeing all of you there. Peace out.